to tell you that I don't know if everybody also knows that your story, you recently graduated from CCM in musical theater, performed at Carnegie Hall, and was named One to Watch in 2022, and is now the lead in one of the biggest productions, Anastasia. So is this a pinch me moment? <laughs> uh, absolutely. Every night I'm kind of just like, how is this is my life i feel so lucky and just so excited every night to get to do this uh, especially because it's something that i love to do absolutely so when you got the call or the email or the text i don't even know what they do now um were you complete i mean what did that moment feel like it was surreal i was just i, I was waiting you know to see what was going to happen and I just was so excited when it finally came in and it was the news that I wanted and I was just like goodness like this is actually gonna happen and then I had to wait a couple months and then it happened so it was really exciting oh my gosh those couple months must have been like okay what's really going on here <laughs> right you have to just like wait for something to start you know right right so as a young girl did you always know you wanted to go into this business knew when I was in like my early teens that I really enjoyed it I think I always loved musicals growing up I never knew that it was something that I could really pursue until I went to like a performing arts camp as a kid and I was like oh okay yeah like I really want to do this this is really fun to me like I can see myself really being able to do this as a career absolutely so do you have a favorite there's so many incredible scenes do you have a favorite scene my favorite scene right now, I think it will change as time goes on, but right now it's the train scene. Uh, it's a song called We'll Go From There. It's just super fun for me because it's like the one time I get to be with the entire cast on stage and it's kind of intricate and it's just a lot of, it's a lot of fun and the music is really fun in that scene too. Wow. So the costume, the staging, honestly, it's truly magical and captivating. Do you have a favorite costume that you get to wear? My favorite costume is probably the big red dress. Um, it is, it just is so fun and flowy and I get to like fall down in it, which I wonder from an audience perspective, if they're like, oh my God, how is she going to fall in that dress? But there's like a lot of padding. Right. It's really nice. And um, then when I get back up, I just feel like, oh, yeah, I just did that. I fell in, like, this really big dress. It's really fun. Right. It's like, oh, it's like the princess and the pea. It's like you just uh, layers, right? <laughs> That's yeah, exactly. awesome. Very heavy, too, so. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, so what advice would you give the younger generation that want to go into this business? What would you say? Um, I think that I would say that you have to just work really hard and, and, you know, stay in your own like lane in terms of don't let others kind of get in your head about right. things. Like as long as you know what you're doing, like that's all that matters really. Uh, I think that when people start to like let other people in their heads or, you know, let others influence them, that's where you kind of like steer off course. Um, right. As long as you just stay, like, you know what you're doing, you know what you prepared, that's all that matters. Oh, that is terrific. And you know what? Thank you again. And we cannot wait for opening night next week. Anastasia, the new Broadway musical is playing just for a limited time, September 20th through the 25th at the CIBC Theater. Thank you again. Thank you so much for having me. Take care.